everyone, it's Louise here from Crazy Borgies. I hope you're all well and fine on this beautiful July day. Today's video is going to be an unboxing and this one is from the lovely people at FG Normal. So a huge thank you to them for gifting me these products to do a product review for. Okay, so let's just take a deep breath and get nice and chilled out grab yourselves a coffee and sit back and relax and watch me look through these items to find out what I have chosen for today's video or for today's unboxing even first and foremost if I could ask you if you have not done so already to please like subscribe share comment down below follow me on TikTok and Instagram on crazy Borgie's diamond art and hit the little notification bell which will notify you of my future video uploads okay so let's crack this baby open and see what we've got oh we've got the miss the misspelt box again so I'm gonna just start off we've got one got one two three four items to show today so let's start off with the off canvas item this one the box yes so the box is a little bit squashed so I've got one off canvas and three diamond paintings so there we go right so we have got the misspelt handmade diamond panting it was only because somebody pointed it out to me the other day on an unboxing video. I can't remember who it was that it was misspelled. <laughs> I didn't even notice. But I'm noticing it now. So um, the box is a little bit squashed. But that is not FG Normal's fault. Because as we all know they don't exactly handle packages in the postal service very carefully. Okay. So let's see what I chose. Oh, it's wooden, it's wooden. There we go. So, it is all sealed in its own little bag as well. So, it's obviously a wooden ornament. As usual, I will link all of today's products in the video description box down below, along with any discount codes that I have. And I will also give a link to just FG Normal just so that you can have a little window shop. There we go, let's zoom you in. Right, so standard kit, pink, pink pen, green boat and pink wax. Yes, that's all you need if you're new to diamond painting. Okay, so we've got a black base. We've got our lovely diamonds which has some specials in, I can see. And let's get this little one out. What is it going to be? Oh, isn't that cute? <laughs> I'm loving all these little cute ornaments that they're doing at the moment. So, look at that. Isn't that adorable? I don't think I was expecting it to be as wide as what it was. I was expecting it to be about this height, but not as wide. So that's a lovely surprise. But look at the eyes on that. So usually my children are a bit scared of anything with large eyes like that. But I'm hoping this one, they won't be because it's a unicorn. So yes, and it's a unicorn with a little star on the top of its horn. So yes, let's, let's give it a measure so I can tell you briefly what the dimensions are. I'm in the garden once again today. So you can hear the noisy birds going over. And I'm in a bit of a rush today because I've got to pop off to an appointment this afternoon. And the heat is back, guys. The heat is back in the UK here. So I'm not liking it. But I've got the umbrella up. So that's the main thing. Right. So I would say this is about 21 and a half centimeters height wise okay and then width wise at its widest point is 
18.1, 18.1 or 0.2 centimetres, okay? So yes. So he is gorgeous. He is just truly adorable. And as many of you know, I'm now doing like a little, a few little off canvas projects. So there we go. So let's have a close up look. So nice, clear. Nice, clear. Here, let me zoom you up a bit more, guys. Oh, that's very close. Nice, clear drill field there. I think we've got nine colours on this one and all the symbols are numerical, so that's nice and easy. So we just simply follow the numbers on the bag and match them to the corresponding numbers on here. Nice and simple. It's what we like. Nothing too challenging. Right, let's have a look now. I would like to give the glue a sniff because I like to find out if it's a bit pongy, if... If we need to do it in a well ventilated area so it does have a nice thickness as well it's not not a tiny little thin piece of wood so that's good I always struggle to get come on you can hear all the birds in my garden they're all I don't know if they're all going through something to be honest with you I think it might be mating season because they're very loud at the moment like literally all day long that kite bird that I show you I showed you on the short if you're new to my channel check out my short from yesterday's um, uploads and you will see my friend I call him although I don't know if he thinks he realizes he's my friend <laughs> but he sits on the top of a tree and all he does all day long is just go making that that screeching noise and it's nice at first but after a while it's a bit like oh will you shut up <laughs> but he's been doing it all day yesterday all day he's a bit quieter today so right adhesive is nice and sticky but they always put a good layer of adhesive on these off canvas projects so let me just take a little sniff no there's no scent at all on that glue which is brilliant lovely lovely but he is just he really just jumped out at me because as i said my little girl she loves unicorns well my both of my little girls do love unicorns and everything so yes gorgeous absolutely gorgeous really like that so at some point in the new f near future i will be doing a whip and chat with that item i've got quite a few little off canvas items now to get on with so let's have a look at the diamonds oh gorgeous let's start off with the specials so we have some large round gold domes there, lovely, lovely quality too. We have some pink pearl domes with an AB coating on, the Aurora Borealis coating, which for those of you who are new to diamond painting is an Aurora Borealis coating it's an iridescent coating even that's applied to the top of the diamond just to give it like a northern lights effect so when you move it around it throws off lots of different rainbowish northern lights sort of colors and it's really really if you love sparkle ab coating is the way to go yes we have a black we have a blue, I think this is predominantly for the body, it's, no, for his hair even, sorry. Another blue, a yellow, a hot pink here in the rhinestone, and 
an amber colour. Whoops, it's a bit clear, a bit near, isn't it? And a clear, bag of clear. They look really good quality, these diamonds, so that's good. Lovely. Right, next item is a diamond painting. My camera has been a bit of a wobbly thing this morning. Okay, let me just twist you there. That's a bit better. So, this I think is a 30 by 30 centimetre full drill. Okay, and it has 21 colours. Nice little snack size, and look at that, it comes in all the baggies, all prepared for you. Lovely. Standard kit once again. Okay, and I saw this, oh the canvas is so soft guys, really soft, which means it's not going to take long to flatten out at all. As usual I will give this in the summary at the end of the video, I will give you all the prices so you know a rough idea of what each item costs okay so i hope you're all looking forward to the weekend guys yeah i think it's going to be a hot one here in the uk from what from what the temperatures are now it's only about 11 here in the uk so adhesive is nice and strong which is good 21 colours in this one. Do you know, every day I always think to myself, I must bring my little straightener out. Hang on one second. Let me go and grab it. Hold on one second. Right, I found it. These are good for helping you to get your canvas to lie flat as well. Excuse the aeroplane. Yep, a little tin can aeroplane up there. So there we go. So it helps it a lot to lie flat and to get out. To get out your air bubble. Your air bubbles even. She says, and then she puts a, a great big crease in it. I'll tell you, there. I'm hoping to get one of those large ones soon. Those large uh, straightening tools, because yeah. a little bit better I think well, I'm so happy it's Friday guys I really am there we go so it's lying really nice and flat now sorry about that guys right so that is the canvas which has lovely love hearts some flowers it's got lots of different things going on looks like it could have a few sweets there in the background as well but yes it is confetti heavy this one but because it's only a 30 by 30 it wouldn't take that long to do so we have our dmc codes we have two legends one either side and the symbols are all alphabetical okay let's zoom you up 
nice clear nice clear drill area there and very good adhesive excellent there's our legend there with all the DMC codes so all alphabetical no funky symbols at all which is great to see does anybody else look for some funny words in their drill area I don't know why I always sort of try to see if I can find any any weird words in here there we go right so I'm going to show you the thumbnail when we eventually get to the top <laughs> oh dear it's one of those Fridays today guys it really is I'm really tired today end of the week tired so there we go that's the thumbnail so like love hearts and a few sweets and all the bad stuff but we've got love hearts there so it makes it all right that's the item number and the size of the canvas and it's always important to remember that your canvas size is what the size is it's the overall canvas size so not the diamond painting area okay so it's usually 25 by 25 or roughly thereabouts let's have a look yes so this one is just slightly over so 25.3 or 4 yeah centimeters okay yeah okay whoa I'm not having a good day today guys I'm getting all hot and flustered here now there let's lift you up a bit there we go so I'm not going to take the diamonds out because they're all perfectly lined up so I'm just gonna well zoom you in so we can see these gorgeous 21 colors of pure happiness so they're all bright colorful cheerful colors most definitely lots of pinks in this one pinks purples blues creamy color there I think that's a peachy color as well coming in so yeah lovely lovely they are so gorgeous these colors these are my happy colors here a very bright green there as well so lovely yes good quality diamonds as always right hold on while I get the next canvas out guys right next canvas is a partial yes you know how I'm partial to a partial excuse the pun Oh dear, my jokes are getting worse as I'm getting older, guys. They really are. Okay, right. 30 by 40, partial drill. So a partial is where you only diamond paint some of the painting, not all of it. And some paintings, some pictures even, I think are better off as partial. If there's a lot of things going on, in the background sometimes when it's a full drill it can really pixelate it so sometimes as I said you're best off with a partial than going for a full drill where it can be very pixelated so there we go put my little straightening tool on so oh yeah no the adhesive is just where we need to place the diamonds so that's good let's just 
just put this over like so. So we've got a little birdie, cute little birdie, and let me lift you up slightly. And a gorgeous butterfly, yes, lovely. There. I don't know why my camera is not helping the situation. I'm going to put you at an angle now it's easier for me there so can you see all of it guys so we have some lovely sky up here and then some gorgeous flowers down here two little gorgeous butterflies and a tiny little birdie here as well and I can tell just by looking at it we're going to have a lot of specials on this one which is fabulous we have just nine colors we have all the crystal codes listed down below and we've got a fun now as well whoops there's the fun now and the item number the size and the drill area is nice and clear as always there we go lovely so let's have a look at our gorgeous diamonds all nine of them to the diamonds this morning what is going on with my hands today guys I was up till late diamond painting that's my excuse anyway and I really was I was up till 1am this morning diamond painting just finishing off that um, the beach scene that I diamond painted with yourself the other day right so we have these teeny tiny little teardrops that are quite fiddly to work with in a clear. We've got a oh, gorgeous, large, bright pink, sort of like a magenta colour actually. And the quality is superb, I would say. Look at that. And we've got two big bags of them. So they are going to go on the flowers, as, yeah, I think are they called geraniums, that's it, that's the word I'm looking for, geraniums, but they are gorgeous, we do have a little bit of trash there, but you know you're going to get a little bit of trash as long as the actual diamonds are okay, that's the main thing. Now I can see one in the background here has a little bit of excess around the side, all you need to do is either cut it off or file it down with a nail file it comes off quite easily guys to be honest with you okay we have a red dome and then we have a b coated black which throws off the metallic -y, sort of bluish shade from the a b coating yes Okay, we have a blue, 
just wondering where number six would go. Oh, that's going to be gorgeous. That's outlining the butterfly. One of the butterflies. So, blue. Another hot pink there. magenta -y sort of colour. A yellow. Green. And then... A reddishy sort of pinkish shade there. Really light pink, I'll say, with a bit of red in it. There we go. Lovely quality, though. Excellent. Really happy with that one. Okay, last one now. Okay, let's get into this one. Is a thirty by forty. And guess what it is, guys? Whoops. It's a toadstool. Toadstool house. I have lots of toadstool houses. They are one of my passions, guys. For sure. Let me just give it a little roll. And where I find my little straightening tool now. Very soft canvas. This one comes all pre-bagged as well. I've just made it a lot worse, a lot crinkly this. So I need to find my straightener tool quick. Where did I put it? Oh, there we go. It's right near the camera, honestly. Right. Let me just zoom you up a bit okay just excuse the mess over there guys it's not a very nice view is it seeing my rubbish okay right let's have a look here this one's a full drill it has 21 colors all the symbols are alphabetical and we have two DMC codes, two DMC, two legends, one either size. And we have a thumbnail, which I will show you in a minute. There we go. Adhesive is nice. Now this one I'm slightly worried about because there's a lot going on in this one. So this one might be one of the ones that would be better off as partial, but we will see. We go into it open-minded. There, we've got all our, our air bubbles out now. Air bubbles? Air bubbles. I oh, can't talk. Anyway, right. So that is the picture of a gorgeous toadstool house i could live in that quite happily actually i think all of us could that is stunning and it looks really good through the camera as well the render looks okay I'll zoom you up to show you the the drill area looks really good And I will show you the thumbnail now. So that's the thumbnail. And the item number and the size. So this one I can tell would be 25 by 35 as well. Okay, because can just tell by looking at it I'm not going to measure it so there we go but it's beautiful I really like this with the toadstools the little lights making it all cozy oh what is that bird going on about and the flowers it's just a really nice cozy sort of looking toad house isn't it lovely 
very fairy tale land yes so there we go let me just have a look at the diamonds for you so or for myself even these ones on let's have a look they are all bagged up but they don't have to the other ones let me see they don't have anything on the packs that correspond to the um the canvases so it's important if you store your diamonds separately to your canvases which most of us do because we like them nice and flat when we're working on them that you put a label to with the canvas number one because these ones don't have anything linking it up either so you don't want to get your diamonds mixed up okay so let's have a look at these these ones are bagged up but they're not lined up as nicely as the other ones so we can just see briefly there they're nice orange there it's going to be lots of pinks in this one i think we do have a navy blue that's going to be for the sky behind this one is going to be confetti heavy for sure we do have patches of color blocking but if there's most of the time with 30 by 40s if there's a main focus point in the middle of the painting that's where the confetti will be and then the color blocking will be around the outside of the painting okay Right, I'm going to hop off now and I'm going to get my prices for you so I can give you a rough idea of what these beautiful items cost. So just hold on one second. Okay guys, I've been on the website so the prices for the items are as follows. Now this is true to the, the today's date which is the... Let me just check what the date is today. Is it the 8th? No, it's the 7th the 7th of July so the prices are as follows so for the 30 by 40 mushroom house that one is on the website for $4.99 okay for the partial gorgeous butterfly with the special shapes that is $6.35 that is usually a bit you know the specials cost usually a bit more because I think it takes it's a longer process to make the diamonds I think so and for the 30 by 30 full drill canvas of the love hearts five dollars eight cents and for this gorgeous little unicorn wooden ornament seven dollars ninety nine guys so thank you for joining me for today's unboxing i hope you've all enjoyed it let me know what your favorite one is in the comments section i think i'm torn between the special and this little guy because he is very very cute okay so i hope you all have a blessed remainder of your day i do i will get through all the comments i'm just feeling a bit meh today i think it is that friday feeling where you're just feeling really tired but anyway thank you so much for joining me take care god bless look after yourselves look after one another and i hope you all have a beautiful weekend okay take care god bless and i'll speak to you all soon bye for now guys